China's movie box office receipts just passed the $3 billion mark for this year. It's ranked as the world's second biggest film market after the United States, but its movies rarely achieve commercial success in English-speaking countries. Lack of exposure is certainly part of the problem, so a film festival in America's capital is looking to change that. CCTV's Kate Fisher got a ticket. Just some of the vast range of films being showcased here in Washington at the DC Chinese Film Festival. The aim to connect culture through cinema, and it seems to be working. I've been studying Chinese for about five years now, and so my teacher invited me, and I thought it'd be pretty interesting to come and see. It's really good. It's really interesting like, to learn about the part of China that like, you never really hear about. The bilateral relationship between China and the United States in the future is incredibly important. So this is a way for people to really develop uh, relationships and understand one another. Since more and more Chinese people would like to come to America, and uh, I think uh, every um, many people want to know more about Chinese culture. And beyond cultural relations, it's good for business too. Since last year on, China is becoming the second biggest market in the world for films. And people predict in the next half decades or so, China may very possibly become the biggest film market in the world. So it's time people pay more attention to what's happening in Chinese language cinema. And that's not just paying attention to the films themselves, but also how audiences get to watch them. A lot of uh, filmmakers like myself from the US has a lot to learn from. Um, new voices, new stories. Um, new ways of distribution that uh, in U.S. Uh, still doesn't work, like uh, video on demand doesn't work perfectly for a lot of the independent filmmakers. Uh, there was an example at this festival that uh, received 20 million hits uh, for an independent film, which is uh, uh, very unheard of, actually. Another online success is Red Fog. Its director says it was great to have the chance to see his work on the big screen. You know, it's my, my, my premiere. Like in DC, so it's it's great. Yeah, doesn't matter if if it won or not. One of the attractions of this festival for directors like Hei Fan is the opportunity to address subjects not always acceptable in China. The program director hopes that will help the DC.